This is going on for like 10 to 15 minutes and you think in this 10 to 15 minute time span or, or a little bit later, you know, I would have already made my move, you know, introduce myself, ask for her number, her snap, her Instagram, whatever. I got cold feet. I got really What's up guys, it's your boy Diamond. Welcome back to Diamond Up Cuz. Before we get to the video, I want y'all to like, comment, and subscribe to join the ride and be with your boy Diamond. We almost had 100 subscribers, bro. In under a year, the channel has been started. We are almost at 100, that's crazy. The NBA uploads, bro, Um, I've made the decision to not stop them. Once the series is done, that's when I'm going to talk about it to make more room for my variety content because, hey, if I want the channel to be what I want it to be or what it needs to be or what it's destined to be, I got I gotta branch out. I gotta make things better. I can't just rely on the NBA forever. But if you could tell by the title of this video, this is how I sold the bag at the mall. You lost your ass too! Now what do I mean by selling the bag? I mean by a female, bro. So I saw that I was I went to the mall that day, you know, the Triangle Town Center, you know, and you know, I'm just walking around, looking around, looking at shoes, looking at clothes, buying some clothes, you know, buying socks, shirts, t-shirts, you know, head apparel, things like that, regular teenage things. And I go to Aldo because I needed some dress shoes. You know, I wanted to look around, they had like a really good sale going on, like 50% off like everything. So I was like, you know what? This is like $200, now it's $100. I, I'll get this. And while I'm looking around, I see this. I see this woman, bro. I see this girl, bro. She looked about my age. You know, she about 15, 16. And like, I'm like, whoa. Cause she, she bag out like Riri for real, bro. Like. I was like, dog, I can't let this go. I can't let it slide. Like Berlizzi, I cannot let this slide. I have to make my move, you know? I'm looking at her, she looking at me. We given both the same the same feedback. We given reciprocal feedback. Like, it, it was looking great. And this was going on for like 10 to 15 minutes. You know, I'm looking around the stove. I see her, she looking at me. I look at her, I catch her looking at me. She catch her me looking at her. You know, I'm checking her out. She checking me out. She, she want me, she want me, she want me. You know, this is going on for like 10 to 15 minutes and you think in this 10 to 15 minute time span or, or a little bit later, you know, I would have already made my move, you know, introduce myself, ask for her number. I'm sorry. I didn't. I really didn't. I, I got cold feet. Oh, brother, this guy stinks. I got really got cold feet. Like I was putting all this scenario in my head like, yo, I'm about to come up to her like this, whoop -de whoop whoop. And when I made the decision to do it, I did it. And I left, and she left the shoe store before I, she bought like some boots, bro, or some. She bought some, and I could not, I could not, like, I, I didn't make my move. Like, I, I got cold feet. <laughs> and she went towards Macy's, bro, I wanted to chase after her. I'm, I, you could call me down bad, but I was ready to chase after her, like, yo, I need your number, I need your name, I need your number. You know, like Tyler Creator, what's your name? And who is this mystery lady? I need to know who this mystery lady is, bro. I need to know who she is. And if she's somehow looking at this video, please, my, my Instagram is in the link in the description. Hit me up. Am I being overzealous over this mystery lady? Maybe. And I was thinking about it the entire ride back. I had sold the, it was like, let me put it in NBA terms for you. I'm like Ben Simmons, top of the key, wide open, right? This is for game. I'm about to call game on these fools, but one problem, I'm Ben Simmons. I don't shoot, I can't shoot. I'm scared to shoot my shot. Simmons, they cleared out for him. Backing his way in. Spins on Gallinari. Gives it up. Oh, he was right there. And I'm going up for the shot, but I pass it off and it go out of bounds and I turn over the ball and the game is over. That's exactly how it was. I sold the bag so hard that I looked like Ben Simmons. Moral of the story, bro. Shoot your shot when you got it, bro. Even if you're the worst shooter in the league, you gotta shoot your shot because whatever happens, happens. Why? Because you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. So man, if you enjoyed the video, I want you to like, comment, and subscribe to join the ride and be with your boy Dami almost at 100. Bro, shoot your shot, even if you're even if you're the worst shooter in the league. Please, I beg of you, shoot your shot, no matter what. Because I sold the bag pretty hard over here. I sold it, and I don't want to sell it again. And if she's watching this video somehow, please hit me up. I'm not down bad. I just want to know who you are for real. Because I need to know your name. What's your name? All right, man. God bless. How can you like a video and not like it? God bless. Peace out. 100.